common question that I get is, how do I close? How do I close? How do I close? I want to close. I want to know how to close. How do I close a client? One of the things about the sales process is it is in fact a process and there's variations of it and they all work and they can all work and they work best when you're not scripted, when you're not acting a part, when you're being you that's the higher level stuff. One of the things that I've realized is not everybody knows what the actual fundamentals are, what the principles are, what the process is, the sales process, i.e. the sales conversation. Everybody knows close, but there's more to it than that. I wanted to give an analogy about this, um, about the whole getting client thing. And I think this will help make it make sense. Closing a client is like getting married. So basically everybody's asking me, how do I get married? I want to get married. How, that's, that's what I want to do is I want to get married. Cool. I get that. But there's this dating process beforehand, right? To determine if you actually want to get married to that person, right? you need to go through a process to identify if it's a fit for you and this client to become a thing like officially, right? What do you do before you're dating? You're courting, right? You're courting somebody. The getting client thing in a really short period of time looks like this. If you cold call somebody and you end up on a conversation with them and during that conversation, you cover the courting, the dating, the getting married, and then having children. That can all be done on a cold call. It's called a cold call close in, in the sales world. In getting clients, it looks like this. Introduction. You have to inter introduce, right? Whether it's on a phone call or via an email or you walk into their business, there's an introduction part. Then there's the qualifying part, the dating part. When you learn how to drive a stick shift car, if you don't understand how to drive a car, like what it does and turn it on and the windows go down, it's really hard to just get in and go drive it on a race car track 200 miles an hour, right? So where I'm going with this is everybody wants to know how to close. How do I close? Teach me how to close. What do I say? What What's the magic phrase that I can say and all of a sudden, they're like in love with me and they give me money. Not the case. The process beforehand, before you get to the closing part, is the most important part. And it's where all the work's done. Literally, 98 or 99% of all of the work is done in that dating phase. Yes, this, isn't, this can happen in one conversation. For most people, that probably won't be the case until you get good at it. Um, before you get married and bring on a client, close them and they say, yes, right. I do. Um, you got to qualify them. That's the dating process, making sure that they're a fit for you to go to work for, do your thing for bring on as a client so you can produce results for them and helping them understand what you bring to the table and what your value is and why you're the right choice and the results that you can get are the results that they're looking for and hoping for. It's the dating process, the qualifying process. My question on this was, you want to know how to close? Here's how. You got to qualify them. Well, okay, cool. There's an entire process to the qualifying them thing. And there's Millions of ways to do that, but it comes down to a handful of very, very basic questions. Okay, cool. Well, if you're going to be asking somebody questions, what do you need to do before you can ask them questions, before you get them to the point where you can ask them questions? Well, you've got to have an introduction. Some people call it greeting. Some people call it intro. I call it intro. On phone sales, the, the best thing in some people's eyes is a cold call close. You walk into the bar, you dial the phone, you make eye contact, 
you talk with the gatekeeper. You go over and say hello. You get the gatekeeper to pass you to the to the decision maker. You start a conversation. That's the introduction. Oh, you're whatever. Cool, blah, blah, blah. Back and forth, back and forth. Introduction. Cool, yes. Makes sense for us to actually have a conversation, right? So then you sit down next to her, him at the bar, and you begin the conversation. And then you go through the process. And then pretty soon you're dating and you're laughing and you're telling jokes and, and you're really getting along and everything makes sense and blah, 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 blah. And then pretty soon it's like, hey, I'm in love with you. Will you marry me? That's the close part. So there's more to it than closing a client. There's more to that process than just closing. There's no magic phrase. There's no unicorn dust. There's no, you know, there's no script that is the end all be all. There's a process that underlies that whole thing.